have a lot of privilege. If they don't walk that day, they don't seem to eat. Hi my loves, how are you guys doing? Hope you guys are good, hope you guys are safe. Welcome back to another video. For those of you who are new here, hi, my name is Carissa Hovey, also known as Visual Diaries by Harris. Please do not be a stranger here. It's all good by here. Please do not forget to like, subscribe, share, and leave a comment. That way the algorithm helps push my content to more people across the globe and for those of you who have subscribed i want to give a shout out to you all because you guys are the best thank you so much for you know, your subscribe for your love for your encouragement you guys are really 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 the best so as you can see by today's start to you already know what it is now i'm actually doing this because i want to clarify things I'm not coming here to make you look as if oh maybe uh, I have money, yet I have money in Jesus' name. You get what I mean? But I'm not coming here to show off no. I am actually filming this content to actually help somebody that actually needs this content. So if you know somebody that needs this content, please, please, okay, do not be keep. You need to share this content because it is very, very, very important. If you live in Nigeria and you know what is going on currently, like you guys know how the prices of things has gone crazy, like it has tripled. You know, something that you get for five thousand naira now you're getting it like for fifteen, twenty thousand naira. Like that is how the economy is. And of recent, which was Thursday, first of August, people had to come out to protest because it's crazy. Because I'm actually just thinking there's some people that don't really have a lot of privilege. And if they don't work that day, they don't seem to eat. So I think about this and I'm like, God, please just help us in this country because you no, know, things have gone extreme. But yeah, so why I'm actually creating this content is because I also watch another creator create she did a video like a day in the live vlog and she actually showed where she went to get some of her food items and she made mention of Boku and when I heard her name, I hope I'm pronouncing it well. I was scouting around to like I beg, where is the process Boku to me? Like I need to go and find. And thank God luckily I found one. And um, I went in, I got some things which I'm actually going to be showing you in this video. I also went to George Street as well, I got some things and I went to the local market and I also got some things. So all of that should be seen in this video. And um, and I also will be making mention of the prices of these things. But I just need to just clarify the reason why I'm doing this video is because I also need to, you know, help somebody out there when it comes to food and prices, like places where you can actually get, you know, some food items that you know, are still within, should I say, the reasonable price. Yes, so that's why I'm actually creating this content, please. I need you guys to actually note that. I'll talk about my experience. Um, when I went to Boko because I noticed some things so I just need to also just put that out there so Boko there are some things that you know I would say when it comes to prices it's reasonable and you know it's not the same in just right you know every market have their prices experience in Boko so the day I went to Boko I don't know if that is how it is in all the 
of communications, but the one I went to, they were just three staff, apart from people in the bakery, that were tending to us, and I would say um, there were like three people doing multiple people's job, you know, one was supervising, the other lady that was supposed to actually even come and help at least make the whole sales experience you know, faster. She too, she was also trying to do and um, do supervisor and all of these things. There's Q. So who are we going to attend to also? This one person can't do this job until somebody had to put that hand like, okay, you need to come and ask us to make it really quick. Another thing, I never knew that um, the pool actually sells their bags, like if not for food, they will just write sells their It is actually written there. The bag, I think it's 100 naira or 100 years so I'm not really sure. If I see how the receipt, I will actually show it to you guys. I think it was 100 naira, yes. But before they do that, they will definitely will ask you, um, do you want to get a bag or you have your bag. So what you told me do you want to get the bag? I was like, yes. I thought it was the no one very nice buckle bag that was I thought maybe it was that one. I didn't know that it was nylon bag. I'm like, uh uh-uh. do people pay for nylon? I don't know that buckle actually deals with mostly food. So if you're going there, even though they have eye for other things, but it's not as much, you don't really see a lot of varieties when it comes to like skincare body care, shampoo, you know, all of that, you don't really get to see much of it, you know, like other shopping malls that you get to see like Jendo and Just Drive and ShopRite. So their main focus is mainly food, so other things to put that out there, so that if you are going there to say you want to go there to get one other thing that is not food, you know, you may not get to actually see that, so the best place is to check other places. If you have shopping malls or supermarkets, then you know that the prices are still reasonable. And please share because at this point we all need it. If you have, so thank you very much. That is my own little shopping experience with Popo. And you know, I'm going to just try it a lot, number of times, and so far so good. Customer service is okay, even though their tax there can be overwhelming, but. Yeah, it's what it is. So thank you very much. Please feel free to also share yours as well. And I'll see you guys in my next video. But this video is not over yet. But you guys have been seeing the things I got. So bye. So I got this for one four. I got this for one four. Then I got this for one three. I got this for two six. I got this for three seven hundred. I got this for two seven hundred. And I got this for two eight hundred, including this. I think it's more like a promo thing here. So, and I got this for one thousand five fifty. For one two, I got this noodles for six thousand three sixty. I got this for one five, one five. I got this for eight hundred and thirty naira. I got this for one two. I got this for eight hundred and nine naira. I got this for five hundred and eighty naira. I got this for focus. I got this for one thousand nine hundred and twenty naira. So I got this for seven hundred and fifty naira. It is one fifty per one. So. I got this for 1270 
I got these two air freshener for 780 that's 390 naira per one and I got this for 1000 I got this for 1250 I got this for 1650 I'll be looking for this big one the small one finishes very very quickly I got this for 4530 so onto this section here, I got crayfish, the half um, half cup, I got it for 900. I got palm oil, 1000 naira. See, I bought mito, see mito, 1000 naira, <laughs> oh my god. Then I bought, I bought pomo, 300. I got this for 500 naira. This is 450 then because the guy didn't have change. I collected one of these. So everything like this is 500. I got green. It's vegetable green. It's called green. I don't know what name it's called, but I know it has green. I got 200 naira own. So I got all of this for 500, 200, 100, 100 naira. That's 300. This is a good seed. Some of you may know it as um, melon. I got this for 700 naira, I bought half a cup, then I added crayfish to it as well, so everything is 1000 naira. And I got this onions to 200, like this one is small, this one is big, I bought it from somebody from, I got this from somebody else and I got this from somebody else. I got slime and lemon. I have not been pooping well, so I'm going to also have this. So um, I also got Gary, but I can't remember how much I got the Gary. Either for something or so. I can't remember how much I bought the Gary.